all my cute little kittens out there. I've got a friendship haul or friendship care package kind of video. My friend Paula that's a subscriber got me a gift and I'm gonna share it with you. Um, Paula, I gave the big emoji pillow flare because I just felt so sorry for her for having a broken foot and she needed something to cheer her up and that pillow just made her smile so that's why that's not in this haul but she got me this little gnome I don't know where she got the gnome if it was the Dollar Tree or somewhere else um but he's totally going in my camper yard when I get the camper I just have to get a second from Mingo now and we'll have um stick up decorations um for the yard I got the hello gorgeous um I don't know if you can see and then the other two still have the candles in them but I'm totally gonna keep the cup part it says follow your dreams and I don't know if it says scent. I think the scent is follow your dream. Sheer Zen. That might be the brand though. This thing smells so good. Um. And the. Yeah it doesn't have like a scent. And the wild spirit. And this one smells so good as well. Um. She got me this bag with the cactuses on it. This is looking sharp. And then there's goodies inside here. Um, this little frog, it says, no place like gnome. Which was going to be a whatnot that I'm going to put in the camper. Because I'm going to totally do a fairy garden like type decoration in there. Or just plain kind of like what you would expect in a trailer park um kind of decorations or like tv and movies would decorate it um she found these sticky notes that everybody's been hauling um and i'm totally using these in my journal uh she got me the so cute pineapple that says love this and awesome on the side and the coffee and donuts which are so cute um she got me these little note cards that have like the bicycle on them which i'm going to try to figure out how to at least incorporate one of these in my journal I want to do uh, this a video on this um, if I can figure out how to do it you'll see it it's a notebook that you sew in a design in the front and the little designs are on the inside. This is the Jot brand, so I know you can get this at the Dollar Tree. But you get the string and a little plastic needle. And then on the inside, they've got like the little patterns. And instructions and I totally want to do this K and this cactus on mine but it's just holes and you take and you put your pattern like in our own this and you pattern it out I think you put the pattern on the back where it shows on the front but I totally will you be doing this I don't know if I'll do it on or film just as a DUI how you do it 
but I am thinking about trying to um, because I think that would be a neat project and if other people have got this and don't know how to do it or be like does this really work out like it's supposed to kind of video so that possibly may be another video I'm thinking about doing and that was all that was in that little bag um, she got me a smiley emoji cup that is so so colorful and the little sunglass guy emoji I still have not found these emojis in any of my local Dollar Trees and I don't know why um they got the little pillows but they did not get the emojis for some reason um, she got me this thing I just dropped in the floor she got me this wallet that's like a cell phone case thing but it's got the wallet on there again I don't know exactly where she got this I think this might have been a giveaway at a store but put that in there she got me these um, wall art I'm totally probably gonna put on that wall <laughs> she got me the just chill penguin that looks so 80s I cannot stand how cute that is but she got me the little the little flamingo which totally might put this flamingo in the uh, camper once the camper is done that said just chilling she got me the unicorn it says be unique and the other unicorn it says magic is all around us which this in particular since it's got like the stars in the background I think would be so cute if you could get some glow in the dark um, paint and like just dot all the little stars in the background and at night they would glow I think that would be so cute and then the last thing in her bag is this little bag here that this has miscellaneous like nail polish in it and it's just little nail polishes which was a um, declutter of hers that she gave me uh, of nail polish and that was it um, if you see me wear this shirt several times this week just know that I am pre filming a lot of hauls at one time right now so that may be why you see this shirt a lot this week um, but I love all my little stuff I've got to figure out exactly where I'm putting everything now um, and reorganize in here um, there are a lot of stuff in here that I'm just placing in here for right now that will totally be moved over to my camper so when the camper is done 
it will be a little bit less cluttery like that because see like all that computer printers and stuff like that will probably go into the camper so the only computery thing that will probably remain is my laptop um, and like tablets and stuff like that I'm not going to take all my tablets but the big computer um, will probably go out there and work as my TV out there until I can get a smaller TV uh, to put an antenna on because or until my dad buys himself a TV because his kind of <laughs> fell into the floor and broke into a thousand pieces uh, so he's using the little TV I was going to put in my camper in the other room right now so if he buys another TV then I can use that little TV but really it's just whatever happens on Black Friday this year um, on the TV situation out there um, and I totally might just find an old not flat screen TV and put out there because um, dad's worried that somebody might break into that before they would break into the house just to, just seeing it as easy target so I'm trying not to put too much stuff out there that I couldn't replace um, or couldn't move back and forth But we keep it locked, so I don't know. They'd have to break a lock to get in it, so I don't know about that. Um, but anyway, I will see you in my next video. If you like these kind of videos where I'm showing you um, little care practices from my friends, please do comment down below and give me a beautiful like. Um, I just feel so blessed right now knowing that there's so many people that care to do little care practice packages like this for me um, God has blessed me with little gifts like this from people that care every time that I'm getting down and really need it um, I was losing weight, like, really good, and then I kind of got depressed in April because April is a really bad month for me because my anniversary was in April, and decorations in April, and that's two events that kind of make me think about him or um, my husband a lot and so I kind of backtracked on my um, weight loss and I gained 10 pounds of the weight that I had lost back because when I get really down in my depression state I tend to snack a lot and a lot of times them snacks are sweets because sweets are my major major uh, major weakness and I ate two in and the one month I ate two um of the pints of ice cream in that in the month of April I started eating ice cream every night before I went to bed and it's caught up on me so I'm gonna have to start watching what I eat again I wouldn't really watch it when I was eating because I wasn't eating that much but I'm gonna have to stop the snacking again 
and start back the uh, trying to do some kind of exercise well but with my physical limitations it's hard to do much exercise because it makes my bones and joints and stuff like it hurt but my doctor said any physical activity that's above what I average do would be fine and just work generally work myself into doing some kind of physical activity and if it starts hurting just stop um, and let my joints and stuff rest so that's what I'm totally gonna try to work into doing uh, so I'm really wanting to try to get some of my weight off of me since the grief did give me a head start um, this is the first time I've been 10 pounds or more under 400 in several years so I'm wanting to keep going that way and maybe even even it out at 300 and get close to 200 200 and something if I can um, because since I was in high school I've not been under 200 pounds but at 200 pounds with my height that's a pretty good weight for me um, so if I can get into the 200 range I would be tickled so please do pray for me you all that pray that I can have the motivation and the get to doing it um, that I need for that uh, but I've got other videos I've got to record and edit this morning so I will see you in my next video please do give me a like comment down below be kind to one another and enjoy your day don't just endure your day God bless and bye-bye.